if you don't mind me asking, because I know the topic is sensitive, what happened to Usher? I heard about some music executive from the industry back in Harlem. You know, I heard it from some music executives back in Harlem. And I'm not going to speak on their name. They doing uh, programs and everything like that. And they may be doing some programs. They may speak on it themselves. But I heard it from some music executives. What did you hear? Bro, you know, you know how people be talking and we was around some people, something like that. And then some people might say, yo, I don't F with that dude. And we, we, I, at the time, I didn't even know who the F Usher was. You know what I'm saying? It was one of those type of situations. And when probably say, yo, man, I don't F with them niggas. Man, I'm getting out that industry and everything like that. You know, you know, Puff sent this little kid to the hospital. How he sent him to the hospital? Man, nigga was bleeding from the butt. Whoa. And that's what was said. Bro, how old is Usher and how old is Diddy, bro? Cause aren't they like the same age? Like, bro. Oh, I didn't even have a name for the kid at the time. Then you heard, and that's what happened. And that's just, you know, that's something that you heard. You don't know if it's true. You just heard it. So and I don't know. Me personally, bro, any like any gay rumors, bro. If somebody attach your name to some gay rumors, bro, I think it, I don't think they got a reason to lie. It, it got to be true. Cause who's gonna just make it up unless they really out to get you? Like who's gonna just make up some random gay rumors and just throw that on your name, bro? Like come on. I think it's true, and that's oh that's crazy. Just to hear this, and this new thing where they saying that they got kids coming forward and said that he did that. I, I don't man. That shit is crazy. And like I just said, you know, that's just something that I heard. It's something that I didn't know. It's something that I ain't see. You know, a lot of people want to, you know, because Gene Deal has spoken on certain things that I've heard, I have spoken on it. But then they were just trying to say, I know. No, I'm not scared to say what I heard. And if there's any truth to it, then it's truth to it. Let them find it. Things that I've saw or things that I've witnessed and been a part of, I've said it. I'm not afraid to say what I saw or what I didn't see. A lot of people want to make up shit. I don't make up things. When I say Puff go in the room with two girls, you understand, and another guy and a rapper, and then all of a sudden they... Uh, cousin try to go in the room. I throw them up against the piano. They run out the room with grabbing towels and they naked. They still had two girls in the room. But people want to make up a lot of bullshit and say what they want to say and flip it the way they want to flip it. I tell it like it is. But you got these guys, you got these people out here, man, you know what I'm saying? You know, all this shit is for entertainment, man. Some people want the truth. Some people speak the truth. Some people don't even know the fucking truth. It has smacked them dead in the fucking face, brother. But I tell you one thing, it's from my mouth to God's ear. And all these clowns can say whatever they want to say. Like I'm just saying, he lived a rock and roll lifestyle when I was with him, bro. I don't know about his sex addiction and stuff like that. You know, I don't, you know, he was a totally different person, bro. When I try to tell people that they don't understand that. He was probably doing some of the little snake shit, doing some things and stuff like that, you know. But the magnitude and what he was doing with the freak off parties and all like that, yo, I didn't experience that with him. That was not my experience with Diddy. All Puffy. All Puff Daddy. That wasn't my experience with him. And you had no idea who Usher was when you heard about him? I didn't know who Usher was at the time. It's all going to come out some kind of way, bro. All this is God's... It, 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 this is going to be... This is something that was... put in place... And it was the it was it was the design by God, brother, for all this to happen and go down like this. Yeah, I'm confused. So, why was Usher living with Diddy? 
Like, was he, like, signed to his label or something? Was he signed to Bad Boys? I'm confused. And hold on. Let's see. How old... How old was Usher? How old is Usher and how old is Diddy? Let's see. I'm about to Google it right now. Cause bro, that's insane, bro. I never knew this. I never knew this Usher age. So Usher's 45. Diddy's. He's 54. Okay. So now he's, I mean, he's nine years older than him. So yeah, he is older, but damn. And his parents just let him go live with them? I'm confused. Like, so his parents just said, hey, take my son and and take him, like, and let him live with you? Not know him from a, not know him like that just because he's famous? That's crazy, bro. Bro, back in the day was wild. I'm not giving up my child to go live with nobody. I don't care how famous you are. I don't care how rich you are. You, you, you got me fucked up. But, hey, teach his own.